For me, it was a spiritual journey. What will be transmitted is joy. I think this amazing joy. Mm -hmm. Bach is the top of the pyramid of Western classical music composition. You know, I think everything emanates from him. And I, I think because of that, people tend to be very scared and very intimidated by that sheer beauty and, and at the same time so powerful emotionally. I stumbled upon the score in Austria, of all places I was born, and in between concerts, and I was like looking and see Goldberg variation for two pianos, I bought it. Also, in this arrangement, which was a very clever arrangement by Reinberger and further developed by Max Reger, again to take the work on a completely different sphere, not the traditional keyboard work with its own texture, its own ambiance, but almost becoming an orchestral reinvention of the piece. And in that respect, it was very stimulating to discover the work. Because we argued quite a bit about the kind of approach that we wanted to take. And I think it's not a question of that, that you decide on that approach that you want to take and then that's the route that you follow. It's a question of the music speaks to you and you find the reasons to justify it. We decided to do only the Bach with repeats, which we had never done before. On the other hand, I think it was quite stimulating for me personally because I think it created a bit of that improvisatory character on the repeat of the variation. In this respect, I think it worked very well. Every time that we played, we always thought of something different. After we started working there, when you do without the repeats, it actually becomes something that's like a tour de force. It becomes a mechanistic showcase, which there's nothing wrong with that. But it's an entirely different approach to when you actually have something that you play for 75 minutes and it has to capture your audience for 75 mm -hmm. minutes. So it becomes a far more artistic experiment, a lot of art experiment, because that's pretty much what we're dealing with. Music can only be heard, cannot really be explained, nor written about. You know, it can only be played. Uh, so I think the best thing to do is you guys go in by the city and uh, or mp3 or wave or I don't know, stream it and if, once you are there buy the second copy because I'm sure you'll find someone